Hello children, welcome to AIMS India's online session. This is biology session, habitat, adaptations in living organisms, part 7. So in the last class we have discussed about the human activities which uh, distracts the environment and the problems arise due to the destruction of habitat. The methods of waste disposal, we have ended the class with methods of waste disposal. In the today's class, uh, more about uh, the environmental problems we are going to discuss. Are you ready children? Let us proceed. Climate change. Climate change is at another environmental problem that has surfaced in last couple of decades. Okay, from the past 20 years, the climate change every year during the summer, the temperature is raised. A slight change in the climate is also shows its lot of impact on the living organisms. This climate change occurs due to rise in global warming, which occurs due to increase in temperature of atmosphere by burning of fossil fuel and release of harmful gases by industries. The climate change has various harmful effects, but not limited to melting of polar ice caps, the change in the seasons, occurrence of new diseases, frequent occurrence of floods and change in overall weather scenario. Okay, the term weather scenario we are using means the history if you compare the climate at present and some 20 years back the climate, the there is a lot of variation. Okay. So, this uh, climate changes occur due to pollution, atmospheric pollution. Effects of air pollution on plants, if you see, okay, there is a causes of fruit damage, leaf damage. So, we get we are uh, seeing. Uh, Nowadays, uh, chlorosis and necrosis means the leaf, uh, green part of the leaf is killed by the chemical. It is called the necrosis and uh, even uh, mottled spots on leaves, slow growth, less yield of crops and even a uh, cause of premature death of plants also seen these are all the effects of air pollution on animals and human beings if you take the effect of pollution about 40 percent of the human death occurs due to air pollution increased susceptibility to disease okay this is easily susceptible suspect to the diseases, causes cancer and genetic mutations, causes respiratory ailments and asthma, hay fever and allergic diseases. These are all the consequences of uh, air pollution. Even it causes uh, cardiovascular diseases and uh, neuronal diseases means damage of the central nervous system also takes place due to air pollution. Okay, mainly the air pollution occurs in two ways, one is particulate pollution and uh, gaseous pollutants. Particulate pollutants are the metallic particles, dust particles, soot means carbon by the incomplete burning of the fossil fuels, soot is added to the atmosphere, aerosols 
and smoke okay so these are all the uh, pollutants and gaseous pollutants if you take uh, it constitute carbon dioxide nitrogen dioxide hydrogen sulfide and sulfur dioxide these uh, added to the atmosphere which lead to acid rains so these are the impact of acid rains and due to global warming see uh, there is no specific uh, time for these cyclones any time the cyclones are occurring okay during summer also and uh, there is increase in the temperature see the green uh, lustrous green uh, earth surface converting into desert due to climate changes okay next loss of biodiversity the human activity is leading to extinction of species and habitats and uh, loss of biodiversity the ecosystems which it took millions of years to perfect to form are in danger when any species population is decimating disappearing becoming extinct okay the balance of the natural processes like pollination which is very crucial to the survival of the ecosystem and human activity threatens the this uh, pollination by insects because of uh, using uh, uh, abundant usage of uh, these pesticides and insecticides not only killing the harmful insects but also killing the friends of the farmer some insects acts as friends of farmer okay like butterflies honey bees okay wasps so they are all involved in the process of cross pollination which is the major event in the yield of the crop field okay so another example is the destruction of uh, coral reefs in the various oceans which support the rich marine life okay the human uh, invaded or uh, what do you call conquer the space the seabed everywhere wherever the human placed the leg the destruction started okay so the destruction of the forest destruction of the marine wealth that is uh, uh, collapsing the coral reefs will also shows its impact uh, on the marine environment and the terrestrial environment okay so it is uh, very dangerous so destructing the trees may increase the sound pollution noise pollution okay and uh, especially the causes of noise pollution jet plane or rocket take off use of uh, loud speakers and music systems traffic noises industrial and factory noises okay the effects are uh, uh, very psychological disorders hearing disability in human beings sleeplessness and uh, increased heartbeat altered breathing pattern and uh, stress these are all the problems arise due to the noise pollution okay deforestation what is deforestation our forests are the natural sinks of carbon dioxide and produce fresh oxygen as well as helps in regulating the temperature and uh, rainfall okay in a certain region we can determine the rainfall by counting the number of forests the more number of forests there is more rainfall there is more 
fresh air fresh oxygen ok. So, at present the forest covers uh, the 30 percent of the land, but every year tree cover is lost amounting to the country of uh, Panama due to growing population demand for more food shelter and cloth. Due to increase in the human population the forests are destroyed. Not only the wealth the forest determine the wealth of the country, it also determines uh, the health and uh, the natural resources of the country. So, growing of the forest is very very important. Deforestation means clean the green, the cleaning of the forest. Deforestation simply means uh, cleaning of uh, green cover and making that land available for human residences, industries or commercial purposes converting into plots. If this is the foolish behavior of the humans, foolish activity which leads to increase in the pollution and uh, disturbing the ecological balance, which may lead to extinction of uh, many, many natural species. Okay. So, different uh, plant and animal species becoming extinct due to these uh, human activities. So, deforestation is the most uh, dangerous activity, it must be avoided, it must be minimized, it must be stopped. Okay. Next, uh, ozone depletion, so it is also a major problem. The ozone layer is an uh, invisible layer of uh, protection around the planet that protects us from the sun's harmful rays and uh, the depletion of the crucial ozone layer of the atmosphere is attributed to the pollution caused by chlorine, bromine found in uh, what do you call in the form of chlorofluorocarbons, chlorofluorocarbons they denature or destroy the ozone. What is the formula of ozone? O3. Okay. So, during the depletion the ozone is converted to oxygen. So, this is uh, the ozone layer is present in the stratosphere region of the atmosphere. So, once the toxic gases, the gases like CFCs, chlorofluorocarbons, the toxic gases reach the upper atmosphere, they cause a hole in that ozone layer, the biggest of which is above the Antarctic. Okay, in the, the biggest hole is formed near the Antarctic region. The chlorofluorocarbons are banned in many industries and uh, consumer products. The ozone layer is valuable because it prevents the it prevents a harmful ultraviolet rays UV radiation from reaching the earth. The ozone layer is valuable because it prevents a harmful ultraviolet radiation from uh, reaching uh, the earth. Okay? This is one of the most important uh, current environmental problem ozone depletion is a current uh, uh, environmental problem. So, the ozone depletion in the stratosphere, ozone is found in the upper part of the atmosphere called stratosphere, ozone gas is continuously formed by the action of ultraviolet rays 
on molecular oxygen the thickness of ozone column is uh, of the measured uh, in uh, Dobson units actually you will learn in the higher classes. The balance the formation and the disruption gets uh, disrupted due to the enhancement of ozone degradation by chlorofluorocarbons. These chlorofluorocarbons are generally used in uh, the refrigerators, air conditioners, Okay. or we are calling it as uh, refrigerants, refrigerants. Okay. The ozone depletion is particularly marked over the Antarctic region, Antarctic, big hole is formed there. What are the harmful effects of ozone depletion? UV ultraviolet B damages. DNA genetic material causing mutation, aging of skin, damage to skin cells and various types of skin cancers, high dose of ultraviolet B causes uh, inflammation of cornea part of I. This is called uh, snow blindness and even it may lead to the cataract formation of a layer okay, which forms a blurred vision which leads to and exposure to ultraviolet rays may permanently damage the cornea also. Okay. Acid rains, acid rain occurs due to the presence of certain pollutants in the atmosphere what is acid rain? An acid rain it is very uh, due to one of the cause of air pollution it uh, leads the acid rains. The presence of certain pollutants in the atmosphere acid rain can be caused due to the combustion of fuel fossil fuel or erupting volcanoes or rotting vegetation which release sulfur dioxide and nitrogen oxides into the atmosphere. Acid rain is a known environmental problem that can have serious effect on human health, wildlife and aquatic species. So, this acid rains have very serious impact on the living beings. So, especially the oxides of sulfur, nitrogen, okay, when they reach the atmosphere, they combines with the water vapor or the cloudy winds and uh, again come back to the earth in the form of a rain. Okay. The dilute acids mixes with water and reach the earth's atmosphere. So, it may lead to corrosion of the buildings and even the health problems arise in the human, wildlife and aquatic species. Change in the pH okay, in the substrates may lead to several health problems. Okay, children, hope you understood, read the book. Thank you for watching our video. Please subscribe our channel and press the bell icon for receiving latest updates.